What's up everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Sun and Moon. Last episode we took on the first two Elite Four members of the Alola region. We took on Elite Four member Hala, who was a Fighting Type Master, and we took on Olivia, who was Rock Type. Now, I'm starting my lead with uh, Incineroar, because I'm going to guess this is either Psychic or Ghost for this particular Elite Four member. I'll, I can tell by, I might be able to tell by the member. Okay, it is Ghost. Because I remember her from the Ghost Trial. With the Mimikyu. Oh boy. I'm not ready. I've been saying this the entire Elite Four so far, that I'm not ready. Let's do this. Oh god, that's creepy. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Sableye to start off with. Interesting. Let's go for a flamethrower, actually. Fake out. Okay. What's with the fake out mons? How does Hariyama had fake out? And then this thing has fake out. Oh, and the burn, and the burn. I resist that all day, every day, bruh. And that was a crit for the Sableye. Rip the dream. Granted, it was burned, but still. All right, take care of the Sableye. No problem. No problem so far. But I expect things to get harder, no doubt. Palo Sand. Um, switch out. Let's switch into... Uh, so let's switch into Broxish. This might be... This is a bad idea. Why'd I do that? Because Palosan is part Ghost type. And I am part Psyche type. This is going to go swimmingly. No pun intended. This is actually my first time seeing this Pokemon in the game, actually. Look for Aqua Tail for player speed. One hit KO. Nope. Never in a million years. Water compaction? What? Hello? And you're going to go for an iron defense? Alright. Whatever floats your boat. I didn't know I had that ability. That's pretty cool, actually. Okay. Huh? Z move on the Palo Sand. Please no. Never ending nightmare. Oh, Jesus Christ. No. I'm dead. I'm not loving this. <sighs> okay, cool beans. Uh, switch into uh, Lorantis then. Rip. Rip. Broxage. Go for a Leaf Blade. I feel like if I didn't know had, if I did not had that ability, I wouldn't have. Uh... Okay, she's gonna heal. She will be 100% healing at this point. Uh, I'll go for a Solar Blade then. Even though it hit, their defenses is sky high, but still. This is going to do nothing. I think this Palosan has me checked. <laughs> Which is not good at all. May as well put on a mu as much damage as I can before I get KO'd here. Okay, th that that's fine. It's below half damage. Half HP, rather. So I can send 
Wait, can I send in Leo? Yeah, I can. I can use, I can use a dark type move on it. I don't know how much damage it's gonna do. Nice! Took it out, very nice. Excellent. Oh, this is the this is the anchor Pokemon. A grass and ghost type. I can stand against this thing in the uh, flamethrower into oblivion. I'm really tempted to flare blitz, but I'm not gonna do that. Okay, you ate that up actually. You can slam paralyze. I don't think Slam can paralyze. No body slam can paralyze. Okay, level 57. What frost lass? Interesting Pokemon. I'm gonna guess I outspeed. I'm just gonna go for the flamethrower. I don't know speed. I avoided the blizzard. I would, I would have ate that up anyway, but still, I still avoided it, which is nice. And drift blim to end things off. I'll stand against the drift blim and go for a darkest lariat. Ah, oh, here. Wait, is my Z move dark type? It is dark type. Do I have speed? I do. This would be a cool way to end the battle, but I feel like Drifflin might love it. Let's do this thing, Incineroar. We came all this way. Aya! Gone. Peace. And of course the aftermath ability, but we'll still live. So it's okay. Damn. Excellent work. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Yep, there goes your hopes indeed. There goes your hopes indeed. Rip. Arino and Pepperino. Ah, <sighs> okay. The the final Elite Four member awaits our arrival. And I'll of course heal my Pokemon up. I don't like I swear did they did they nerf high proportions? I swear high proportions used to, used to heal two hundred HP. Now it only heals one twenty. Rip the dream. Okay. Whew. Am I ready for the final Elite Four member? Okay, I can tell this is grass. I can tell. It's gotta be grass. Let's do it. The final Elite Four member of the Allure region. Here we go. Wait, that's not Mallow. Who is that? Who are you? She's a golfer. I've never seen you before. I expected it to be Malo. Interesting. Kahili. A few years ago I was champion island challenge too, just like you. Travel around the world and prove my skill both trainer and a golfer. Alright, cool. Wait, flying type team? Shit. There's a flying type team. Uh oh. Not good. Not good, man. Elite Four Kahili. Flying type. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Leads with Skarmy. Luckily, I led with Incineroar, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I did. Now, I'm gonna guess this thing has sturdy, but I'm just gonna go for the flamethrower anyway. And it was between. You 
do have sturdy, of course. That was a crit too. Damn. Since I know you're gonna heal, I'll go for a darkest lariat. And then flamethrower your ass again. Since I break your sturdy. Wow, I did a lot of damage. I'm surprised the amount of damage I did actually. Oh, spikes, you son of a bitch. You know, Spikes reminds me of when I went about Steven in Oras. His scar mode always set up Spikes and talks to Spikes and whatever. Um, oh, Mandibuzz. I don't have anything to combat a Mandibuzz. Like, I really don't. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay in. I keep thinking that, um, Incineroar's part fighting type, I have to, like, instantly switch out. This thing will eat this up, for, eat this up. Like, Mandibuzz is fat, oh, great bird rip. Going down. Okay, I actually took that pretty well, actually. Go for a break break and it won't do much damage, but we'll just go for it anyway. Okay, he's gonna go for another Brave Bird. Should you get the spam Brave Bird? I'm gonna heal after this turn, I think. In before quit though. Okay, I'm gonna heal this turn. A high proportion will not take me to full health, so I have to full restore. I can take her Brave Birds all day, every day, so it's okay. And she's just gonna do more damage to herself anyway. I don't think a Flamethrower is gonna take it out from here. I'll try it though. I'm just gonna hope for a crit. That's what I hope for, a crit. Crit. That's not a crit. No good. She's gonna heal now. Don't hit yourself. Okay, good. Oh, nice. Got the burn. Excellent. That's pretty good right there. You know what? I'm gonna go for a flare blitz. Screw it. I've yet to see Flare Blitz animation. Wow. Yo, that's pretty wild. Let's go and go for the Brave Bird. Do a metric ton of recall to yourself, because why not? And the burn damage. A Flamethrower should take it out from this range. If not, she's going to heal again. I don't have three Flamethrowers left. That's not good. Okay, Mandibuzz is down. At this point, I really wish I had an alleged type. Two cannon. In fact, no, wait. I have Ice Beam on Broxish. What am I thinking? Two cannon scares me, though. Two cannon is a threat. And I'm kind of happy she has one, actually. Because it's a really good Pokemon. Um, I'm going to go straight for the Ice Beam. Oh, for the love of God. Well, I'm not living this. So, peace out, Bruxish. Supersonic Sky Strike. I've not seen this. Oh, sweet Jesus. Well, that was short lived. Um. Hmm. <laughs> Bit of a predicament here. Uh, I'm gonna go into Betty, I think. Why did I go into Betty again? Because I can't use Earthquake on it. In fact, you know what? Betty's a good option because I can use Betty to actually heal up some Pokemon here.
gonna go for the big blast. That does so much damage. No, I don't want to run. I don't want to run. Uh, I'm going to revive. While I'm here, I might as well just revive Broxish. And let Mudsdale go down here. I'm going to send back in Incineroar here. I'm surprised Incineroar's been doing pretty well in this Elite Four, actually. I'm surprised I've relied on it so much. Right, go for the flamethrower. Hopefully this doesn't kill me. Okay, I outspeed. Burn. Damn. Okay, that does a lot of damage. Mm. If I outspeed, um, I'm gonna risk a flare blitz. And hope I take it out. I do have speed. I don't think this flare blitz is going to kill. Oh, it did. Nice. I don't know if I'm going to go down to recall, though. Okay, I don't. Excellent. That was a good play, then. That was a good play on my part. Oh, God. This is intense. Ori Corio. Oh, I don't know what type it's going to be. I'm just going to stay in. What's well, the fire type one? Okay. Uh, with that in mind then, I'm going to heal up uh, Bruxish then and let Incineroar go down. Straight for the aqua tail. I don't know if that was speed. I hopefully it doesn't flinch me or crit me. That's a crit. That's not a crit. Good God. This is a one hit kill. Yes. Bruxish coming through. Level 53. Last Pokemon is a Crobat. I'm going to stay in and I'm going to heal. Because I could really use Broxish to, to take this thing out. I know I don't have a lot of HP either, that's a problem. Most of the air slash. How much? It's going to do a butt ton of damage. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. And go for the Psychic Fangs in hopes it doesn't crit me. Okay, that was a crit. That wasn't a crit. Damn it. It's max damage. Okay, I'm going to send in my own flying type, see how you like it. Really? You carry the supersonic? Bruh. Don't hit yourself. Good. Same again, two cannon. Same again. Same again. Don't hit yourself. Don't get flinched. Don't hit yourself. Yes! Yes, two cannon. Yes! Let's go, Fruit Loops. And we defeated Elite Four Kahili. Wow. Not easy Elite Four members at all. Wow. I'm impressed. Whew. That was a good battle. I I appreciate that, Kahili. I appreciate that. Uh, I'm actually going to heal up my team here because I don't know what's going to happen after I exit this place. So I'm going to heal here and end off the episode here. So I thank you all for watching today's episode. We defeated the Elite Four. 
and it's now time to face the champion, whoever it may be. And uh, I'll see you all then when we face off against the champion of Alola. So thank you all for watching, and peace.